Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Lauren Friedman and I am your neighborhood realtor. I'm here to share with you a stunning duplex in Long Beach today. We're going to jump right into the home tour. As always, if you have any questions regarding this home or living in Long Beach or surrounding neighborhoods, please reach out. My contact information is in the description below. I love hearing from you. Today we're gonna to see a beautiful home at 916 Roswell Avenue. You are gonna meet the agent who is listing the property and the owner as well. Andrew, you wanna take it from here? Hi, Lauren Friedman. We're so fortunate to have you here. We're so excited. Wade, the owner, developer, designer is here. And this is one of my favorite properties. It's such a unique opportunity to live, work, and play all in the same place while making money. You get to live in one side and all your friends, family, and visitors and guests get to stay in the other side. And it's just awesome where you can live for free virtually if you wanted to, just off the income on the other side of the unit. And you get to choose who you want to spend time with and how long they stay. It's amazing. What a great opportunity. The quality and thought and detail that went into the construction of this one of a kind, first of its kind ever approved in Long Beach is phenomenal. You're going to absolutely adore this property. The attention to detail. It's just absolutely completely sustainable. It's state of the art. It's futuristic. And it's the not only is it the first of its kind in Long Beach, but this neighborhood where it's nestled is really up and coming. And so this is a great opportunity for somebody to get in now on the ground floor and redevelopment and enjoy the upward experience that this neighborhood is bringing. So wait, you know, let's go. And it's, it's literally a maintenance free home that should literally be here for about 500 years. It's 100% concrete and steel. Um, the siding is Corton steel, which as it patinas, becomes its protection, it's rated for a minimum of 100 years, you never have to paint it, you never have to stain it. Uh, the concrete floors, the tile floor, literally this house will be here for 500 years. And it's earthquake proof. Earthquake proof, it's termite proof, it's tornado proof, it's hurricane proof, fire proof. And the structure is fireproof. Contents can burn, but the structure yeah. itself is fireproof. That's amazing. Take us inside. Let's let's Please. see the inside. Um, right, I'll let Wade do it. Fantastic. We did uh, custom light switches that we designed and had commissioned, had made. Uh, because the house is concrete and steel, we wanted to show off some of that concrete. We didn't want to hide it. We left the steel beams exposed. House is equipped with full sprinkler system. Uh, it's got a full mini split system. So every room has its own heating and cooling. So you only have to heat or cool the rooms you're in, which proves to be very energy efficient, keeps your utility bills down. Uh, we did the flush border with the tile and with a Schluter metal edge and a shadow edge with the drywall flush to it just to give it a real clean look and you don't get the the marks and stuff you would on baseboards uh, we did museum channel through the entire thing so hanging pictures and stuff you just hang the cables on the museum channel you don't have to put holes in the walls as the walls are all concrete um, you can go through the drywall and stuff but it just makes it easier to do the museum it channel. does they're beautiful and it gives it a nice look it does um, Custom torch cut light fixtures in the island in the dining room on this unit. <clears throat> we had the furniture custom made to go with the railing, so it's all laser cut metal. It's called an XYZ Beautiful. pattern. We did that all the way through the gates in the yard, etc. Uh, the blue, this is an Italian porcelain. Blue is my favorite color, so we had looked at literally every granite yard in Southern California and with all of the grays and blacks and whites, I just wanted something different. Yeah. We walked into the place in Beverly Hills, we saw this, and the minute we saw it, we both looked at each other and said, that's it, that's the one. So it was a very easy decision. Love to cook, love to entertain, so the wine column, fridge, freezer, dual dishwashers, it's coming very handy. It's always nice to have two dishwashers. Yeah, I love to cook and entertain, but I don't like to do dishes, so. It's the best of both worlds. So you can leave them in there for a day or so until no, you... No, you can just put them all in there because you can put the, the dishes and the pots and pans. Perfect. Uh, the microwave drawer in the center here. Sure. And then the heat burner. 
professional range has been uh, very helpful. We had lots of company through the holidays and stuff when we put this kitchen to good use. Thermador is a great brand. Yeah, so. yeah, very good brand. Very happy with it. All right, I'll let you lead the way. Okay. First floor bathroom off the, the kitchen here. First. It's beautiful. I love the finishes. Yeah, we tried to keep it just simple. Kept the consistency of the white tile that we use for the backsplashes we use in the showers as well. We did the master different just to give it a bit of a pop. You even have a rubber ducky. And a rubber ducky. <laughs> you have to have a rubber ducky. You have to have a rubber ducky. And then we've got a pantry here under the stairs. Let you get in there, sorry. It's not lit very well, but. But it's large. It's practical. It's very <laughs> practical. I'm gonna go upstairs. And you do have an exit way. Yeah, there's another exit there. Right here. So I'd walk down the side. With a two-car garage in the back and then also additional parking behind the garage in this neighborhood is very valuable because parking It's key. Yeah, parking parking's at a premium. <laughs> Having an extra space for sure comes in handy. We did tile all the way through, porcelain tile with the metal shooter edge, so it's very durable. With that longevity and low maintenance. And we're on the second floor now. Welcome to the family room. <laughs> We've got laundry upstairs right in the center here. Uh, one of the big pet peeves of mine is so many places that I looked at always had the laundry in the garage or in the first floor. Can you uh, open the door? Bedroom's on the second floor, so I like it's a bit of a mess, but. <laughs> oh, wow, that's fabulous. Very practical. It is. And then the door hardware is all custom as well. We had that all done. The same company that did the switches for us did the door hardware. Beautiful. The same. Hey, let me just show the. Yeah. It's nice to have a second living space. Yeah, we wanted downstairs to be a bit more formal and visit, so there's no TV down there on purpose. TV's up here. And then we did the same trim, same baseboard with the tile and the Schluter edge, just to give it that same look. Uh, guest room here. Then this comes through into the Jack and Jill full bath. I love these closets. Yeah, the doors turned out very nice. It's all a solid core. It's, it's called apricot oak. Okay. And then we just did a black hand, uh, hand wipe stain on it, which turned out beautiful. That is beautiful. We are happy with that. And then the no baseboard as well on the doors, just to give it that clean look. So. It takes a little bit of prep up front. You gotta install the doors before you do the drywall, but it's worth it. Nice little LED light in here. Dual vanity. And then we've got this set up as in the office on our side, but on the Airbnb side, we've got like beds on this room, so. It's also nice to have the separate heating and cooling if you just want to heat or cool one particular room. That's... Yeah, there's only two of us on this side, so the mini split was the way to go because it's it's a large home, so only having to heat or cool the rooms we're using makes sense. It does. Otherwise, you're paying to heat and cool a bunch of rooms you're not in. So. And in Long Beach, we really don't use air yeah. or heat very often. Right, we're fortunate that we Yeah, we are. Right. Uh, powder room here. This was mainly for if you're on the rooftop patio, you can come down and it's right here, which oh, nice. was the thought behind this, so you don't have to go into a bedroom or anything. You've got access to the powder room. Beautiful tile work in there as well. I can't wait to show everyone the rooftop deck. Yeah. So we'll show them the master bedroom and then off to the rooftop deck. Yeah, master suite turned out very nice. We had the solid surface LED mirrors, custom built, so that we had the whole go for it, basically counter to ceiling. Those are all custom designed. And then the same company that did those for us did the bathtub and then also the medicine cabinet. Uh, with the open vanity, we decided we want a, a bigger medicine cabinet to be able to hide everything away. So we got that made out of the solid surface as well. It's a great, it's a really nice, clean look. Yeah. 
yeah, it's able to, I mean, there's lots of stuff because we live here, but. It's... But still, there's great storage, and is there a bathroom back yeah, there? Yeah, there's a toilet closet here, for sure. Okay. So there's four bathrooms in each unit. Okay, great. And then even the toilet paper there. holders we had custom built. Wow. <laughs> Just to accommodate. You did not leave any detail unturned. And then the showers. We accomplished our spa field here. We've got the six wall sprays, the 24 inch rainfall, and the hand spray. Oh, very nice. And all a single solid piece of slate pan, so. That's beautiful. I think you really have to schedule an appointment to come in and see the details of this home. Yeah, the tile it's guys really did amazing. a phenomenal job. They I did. Mean, the transition pieces between everything, they, it, I'm really happy with the work they did. Yeah, you can tell the quality is there. Yeah, they did a great job. And then the master room, we just carried through the, uh, this is actually a European lime wash that we've got in the master on the walls, and we just brought one wall in here with that to carry it through. Beautiful. I love the balcony you have right there. Yeah, just in the light, I mean, with the, the big doors, the eight-foot doors, it gives it a lot of natural light. Nice little spot for coffee and just kind of relaxed coffee. Yeah, it's nice to just sit out here. And we left kind of the skylights there just to let the natural light through as well on the top. Perfect. Well, let's go see the rooftop deck. First, if you want there. Thank you. So the rooftop deck is amazing. You can see most of Long Beach and even part of Signal Hill. Beautiful view of the mountains today as well. Oh, so yes. Mountains. Oh, my goodness. You can see the mountains right from here. And July 4th, we had the best fireworks show in town. Oh, I'm we sure it was amazing. We literally had 360 degrees of fireworks nonstop. And you've got Signal Hill right up there. And Marine Stadium is actually just on the other side of Wilson High School there as well. We've got our pizza oven, fridge drawers, barbecue, dishwasher, sink. And then half of this is for the owner's unit. Yeah, and then the other half and is the, the Airbnb side. Exactly. This is beautiful. Yeah, it's very practical. We've got the gas fire pits up here as well, so when you're up here for special occasions or just a regular night, it's just kind of mesmerizing to sit it's there perfect. and watch the fire. Is there anything else that you haven't told our viewers that would be interesting for them to know about this home? Um, this was kind of just a, a weird thing how it came about. Um, technically in LA County, you're only allowed to use 10% of your roof as a patio, so the inspector kind of saw what we were doing and agreed with it but said we had to work with them so we had to put an eight foot extension on the toilet vents oh, so rather than okay. just have an eight foot piece of pipe sticking out there we got the company that did the railings to basically come up with that for us so it turned it into something nice we put some led solar lit lights there so at night nice. it actually gives us some additional light and it's kind of a little architectural feature but it you know we didn't plan on it that way but it turned out nicely at the end result that's great well, thank you so much for allowing us to tour your beautiful thank home you. today. Nice and to uh, we appreciate all of our viewers watching. Thank you. Thank you.